Hello Harry Potter fans, Peter Kenneth here. Welcome back to the Potter Collector Channel where we are a community of collectors. I'm super excited to bring you products from Zavi. Zavi is partnering with the Potter Collector for this video and Zavi describes themselves as a geeky and nerdy type of brand that is complemented by various franchises like Harry Potter. So they asked me to pick out some items to show you guys and I picked a variety of things to show you what they have available. They have a lot more than what's in this box, but I'm excited to see what everything looks like in person. So let's start this unboxing. All right, I'm gonna put the box down here. All right, where to start? Let's just grab this. It's a poster. They have a variety of posters available on their website, but this one in particular caught my attention. And I will say they have all seven, no, all eight of these available. It's a poster of the poster, the original Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone poster that we saw in movie theaters or cinemas. How fun is this? And it's really nicely printed. It's on a thick cardstock. The printing is really high definition. I mean, Hagrid especially is super high def. And this is what the Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone poster looked like. And this brings back so many childhood memories. We have the trio on here. And then of course, Richard Harris as Dumbledore, Robbie Coltrane, Maggie Smith as Professor McGonagall, and the late Alan Rickman as Professor Snape. So again, as I mentioned, they have all eight of the movies in this poster form. And I think they had a variety of sizes too, which is nice. This was like the medium size. They had a larger one and a smaller size, but this was more in the middle range of those. Okay, next up, I'm gonna save this for last. This I'm super excited about. You have no idea what I'm pointing to, but you are gonna love it as much as I think I'm gonna love it. Here we go, let's pull this out. This is perfect for the Wizarding World of Harry Potter or any of your day-to-day -day activities. It's a Harry Potter themed phone charger or battery pack, so it's a charging bank. You can plug your phone, your iPads into them. But look at this, it has the Hogwarts crest on it and it's good for two charges. It has like a velvety smooth material. It's not velvet, but it, it's like a, a velvety plastic. You probably know what I'm talking about if you've felt this before. But like the poster, I mean, nice print work on the front here of the crest. And then let's press this. Let's see if there's any charge here. Okay, so there's two bars uh, just out of the package. Press this to turn it on essentially. And then to charge it, you would plug this smaller end into the input and then the USB into a wall outlet and then to charge your phone plug the USB into the USB and then this into the phone. So very cool item. This is perfect for Wizarding World of Harry Potter as I mentioned and it is a 5200 mAh capacity. So that's a pretty large size for an external battery. It's a little bit heavy but it doesn't add too much weight so if it's in your backpack or something you're not really gonna feel it. All right what's next in this box? All right there are some clothing items. I picked out three shirts that I loved the design of. So let's pull one of those out. And yes, still love this shirt. Oh, this is so cool. So this is a Hogwarts school list printed on a black shirt. And as you can see, it's multicolored. It transitions from like a gold to a silver color. And this is your full Hogwarts school list. So we have up top the uniform, three sets of plain work robes, one plain pointed hat, then there's some other items, and then book list, history of magic by Mathilda Bagshot, Fantastic Beasts and Where to Find Them by Newt Scamander, other equipment, one wand, one cauldron, one set of brass scales. Students may also bring an owl, a cat, or a toad. We didn't see this whole list in the movies. And if you know about the deleted scene in Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone or Sorcerer's Stone, there's one where Harry and Hagrid are on the tube or what we would call the subway here in the United States in London and Harry reads off a few more of the items that are required for Hogwarts but not this many items so this is from the book which is super cool I love that this is fully licensed we have the Hogwarts crest at the top and it has a lot of fun design elements on the outside of it and then this is of course for the first years this is the first year school list very fun shirt I don't know which one I'm gonna try on so why don't we go through the rest of the shirts now and pick one. All right, the next one is Slytherin themed. 
I thought this was super simple. I love that it's on a gray shirt and the green paint is actually metallic. So it glistens a little bit. I like that the words and the snake are a little bit faded too. So this is gonna be great for Wizarding World Harry Potter as is that Hogwarts school list. Again, like the other shirt and all the other items, these are all fully licensed Warner Brothers products. All right, the last shirt in this unboxing is this chocolate frog advertisement. At the top it says Honeydukes chocolate frogs, 70% finest crocoa, like croak, like frog. And then at the bottom it says free wizards and witches card inside, collect them all. Once again, a fantastic looking shirt that's gonna be perfect for Wizarding World of Harry Potter. I can't wait to wear all three of these. I don't know which one I like best. I think I'm going to wear the chocolate frog shirt. I think that's my choice. And there it is. Very, very cool shirt. I like the placement of the artwork. It's at the perfect location right below your clavicle. Love it. I love the shirt. I love all three of them, honestly. I'll be taking pictures in front of Honeydukes with this shirt. Let's see what else is inside here. I picked seven items because, you know, seven is the magical number of Harry Potter. Uh, again, I'm gonna save that for last. But here is a wand. Now, this is by the Noble Collection. Zavi sells Noble Collection products. And this is none other than our favorite female trio member, Hermione Granger's wand. I didn't have Hermione's wand, so I had to get it. It's a beautiful wand that has a vine design on it. Very simple yet elegant, very much Hermione. And this particular wand came in the Noble Collections regular wand box. You can also purchase some of their wands in collectible versions, but this is kind of like their standard wand box. And then this also comes with a little name plate and you can stick it on your wand. It has some felt underneath the clasps so it doesn't scratch your wand, but there it is. So Zavi sells a variety of Noble Collection items as well as a variety of wands. You can check all of those out on their website, but I'm excited to finally have Hermione Granger's wand. All right, last but not least is something I'm super excited to see. I've not seen one of these in person. This is a new line that Inesco has been putting out. They're statues, and this is the Richard Harris version of Dumbledore, and he's holding Fox. Like, what? If you didn't know, my main cosplay is the Richard Harris version of Dumbledore, so he has a special place in my heart. So let's open him up. I'm very excited excited to see this. Oh, first let me show you the box. I'll show you the box. Here we go. So here's the front and the back. And then the rest of the box is that white Wizarding World print that we all know. All right, here we go. First glance at this statue. Whoa, his glasses are like super small. All right, so he's solid. That's the first thing I'm noticing. Oh my goodness. Guys, the sculpt work on this is Beautiful, you know, like when you see statues of you know characters and they just don't quite get the actor's face right. They got Richard Harris's face right. Ah, oh, this is a beautiful piece. I'm gonna have to use this to design my robes if I make new robes. Oh my gosh! Wow. All right, let's pull Fox out. Fox is super delicate. Holy cow! Look at the feathers on Fox. This is actually better than I thought it would be. This is incredible. I think I'm sold. I am going to have to collect all of these figures. Even the, the stand that he's on is like, this is so artistically pleasing. I'm kind of at a loss for words at how beautiful this is. Like the back, look at the fabric just flowing. He's holding a scroll here. And then here's that base I was talking about. The stone is chipped away and like, it's beautiful. It's really, really beautiful. Here's Fox. Stunning. I mean, look at the back of Fox. Look at the feathers. So this really is a 360 statue. This needs to be on a turntable, honestly. So the way you attach Fox is there's a little notch here in Dumbledore's arm and then a notch on Fox's feather and he just slides right in into place. Beautiful piece. I've seen pictures of McGonagall and Hagrid. This may have to be the next item to collect. The bottom has a black felt on it so it doesn't scratch the surface you have it on. So you can see it has Albus Dumbledore on there as well as some copyright information. Really nice piece. I don't know where I'm gonna put him but I'm gonna have to find some space up top because this is definitely a piece to display. Like look at how delicate his glasses are. Super small. A big, big thank you to Zabby for reaching out and partnering with me, sending these beautiful items to show you guys. This is a new favorite of mine and cannot wait to see what the others look like. 
Once I get them, I will of course share them with you guys, but Dumbledore I think is a good start to a new obsession of these statues or figurines. If you're interested in purchasing any of these items or checking out what else Zavi has to offer, check the description down below. I have linked the different items that you saw today individually, as well as their main Harry Potter page. They also have other franchises like Star Wars and Disney, but we're here for Harry Potter. Zavi is offering Potter Collector Community members 10% off their entire website and 20% off clothing items. Those coupon codes are TPC10 and TPC20. They're also located in the description down below. I'm also wondering what your favorite of the three shirts were. Let me know in the comments down below. I'd love to see what you thought. If you have any questions about Harry Potter or Harry Potter collecting, please feel free to leave a comment down below. You can also join the Potter Collector community on Instagram at the Potter Collector or on Twitter, at Potter Collector. Now it's time to like, comment, subscribe, and until next time, keep collecting. Thank you so much for watching. If you're new here, welcome. You can subscribe right up here. You can also look at some previously posted content down here. If you have any questions about Harry Potter books or collecting, please feel free to contact me. I'm always happy to help. But for now, I must go. See you next time. Whoa, where'd he go?